and there it is in the dishwasher. What's going on guys? So about a week ago I did a video on this. This is the Spyderco Medium Ceramic Bench Stone. Now, there's one uh, problem with this stone that I mentioned in that video, and that's the fact that it tends to load up with steel a little bit. Now, in the comment section of that video, there's a bunch of different ways that people use to clean this. My particular method is in the uh, green scotch Bright and soapy water, but Spyderco says that you can throw this stone in the dishwasher and since it seems that nobody else on YouTube or anywhere else for that matter has ever done that before and documented it and I looked and I didn't find anything I guess I'm gonna go ahead and throw this in the dishwasher. I really don't want to do this but I guess I'll take the risk. So there's before and that's a completely clean side. This side has never been used so this is gonna be a good comparison side. Before and hopefully that's what it looks like after. Now real quick, I wanna mention one thing that I've noticed with this stone in particular is that if you don't clean it at all and you just kinda of let the steel build up, it almost sort of flakes off on its own. Um, you can almost kinda of see that if you take like a paper towel or something and wipe the top of it, you can see a little bit of that steel coming off. This stone doesn't really seem to get any worse than this right here. And I've used this a bunch. I've used it on Scandi grinds, um, which tend to load up any stone really quickly because there's just so much steel to remove. Um, but that's pretty much what it looks like after a lot of sharpening. Let's go throw this thing in the dishwasher, let it run its cycle, and see what happens. camera in a dishwasher. And there's also a sharpening stone in there. There's no way this can go bad, right? Here it is. No difference whatsoever. <laughs> Doesn't look any different to me. Does it look different to you? For reference, here's the clean side and there's the dirty side. All right guys, let me jump in real quick here. So it actually looks like the uh, dishwasher did get off some of the loose stuff on the stone. Uh, it didn't really look like it cleaned it all that well. Um, I don't really know what I was expecting. I don't know if I was expecting like a super clean stone to come out of the dishwasher or what, but to be honest, I think the normal scrubby pad and a bucket full of soapy water does a much better job and it does it about a hundred times faster. It literally takes less than 60 seconds with a scrubby pad. In the dishwasher, it takes about two hours. So if you're in a hurry, stick to a scrubby pad. One other thing real quick. These are the other two stones. We got the fine and the ultra fine. I've been using it on the past couple days and the review will be coming soon. So stay tuned. Thanks for watching. Just listen.